I'm Diana Felzone for Fox 411. Fair Abraham has gone from reality star to sex tape star and now author. The former teen mom, now 22, joins us in studio to talk about her new erotic trilogy. You've just written three novels, a trilogy. What author inspires you? I currently don't have an author, another author that inspires me. I was just inspired to write the Celebrity Sex Tape series and I think a lot of people are very excited to read it and um, hopefully I give some good creativity with fantasies and erotica in these in this series and maybe Fifty Shades of Grey <laughs> will be like challenged to write more too. Um, I just really enjoy at this time in my life writing about sex <laughs> um, and I think it's because I'm 22 and I'm kind of single and what better way to express yourself in a positive way than writing and I really enjoy writing. Do you worry though um, writing about sex that people are going to keep looking at you as a sex symbol? Is that something that you're okay being associated with? I think I'm okay with being a sex symbol um, and I think moving on in my future and my career that's something that I am proud of and in the same time I'm using it as a positive rather than a negative um, which is hard to deal with at times. Mm -hmm. Have people tried to make any associations um, let's say Jenna Jameson has written a series of books. She had a bestseller. She has yes. another bestseller with Sugar, which is also a fictional novel. Have you ever read her work or looked to her work? Um, I have not, and I try not to read so many other different um, books talking about sex and fantasies and those things because I am trying to do something in my own way um, so that my readers, you know, I just stay true to myself so that my readers continue to like my work in the literary field and mm -hmm. so I'm very excited to share that with them. Would you say that even though these are fictional it's art imitating life, life imitating art? I think everyone when they're writing they get inspiration from their own lives um, but the stories that I have are and I have created with this series is you know different characters um, and it's very I think more fun than my real life <laughs> and um, and that's why I'm very excited to like have all of my fans read this and if it's appropriate for them at this time, then they should read it. If it's not appropriate, because I have younger fans and I wouldn't right. want them to read that right now. Yeah. Um, also, reality television was really your, your platform originally. Yes. Are you going to return to it? I saw the MTV special that focused on you and your daughter, yes, Sophia. Yes, um, Is that going to be something that we can expect to see in the future? I am doing other shows. I just did one with Comedy Central Underground and you will be seeing something else from VH1 from me. I, I think reality television will always be a part of me and I enjoy doing that and I enjoy being real. So reality yeah. is my thing and I've done very well in that. But I am looking forward to grow, grow my portfolio with literary and the books and different genres. So hopefully I'll write a business book. I'll do more fictional things and I'm very excited for that. What's up next for you? Right now, I am in Austin, Texas, and I am creating my first restaurant, and that's really my second baby right now. Mm -hmm. So singing, that was just a fun single you did? Yeah, I just like to do a lot of things for fun. I'm very creative, mm -hmm. um, I guess entrepreneur, and so I enjoy singing, but if I don't, I'm, that's not my career. So. It's just something I enjoy. Yeah, if you have the platform, why not do it? Yes. Now, there's been something in the press that uh -huh. you have taken a public stance against. Yeah. And on social media, where people say that you're a, quote, porn star, and you're saying that is incorrect. What is your definition of a porn star versus someone who happens to be in a sex tape? Okay. I have friends who are in the adult entertainment industry, and that is something where they make their full income off of. That's what they dedicated their life to. and if that's your choice, that's fine. Personally, making a sex tape and that's all I've ever done, that's not, a, that's not being a porn star. Um, I live a very different life than what adult entertainers live. So I can't help what the public perceives from a company and those type of things, but I do appreciate you asking. <laughs> it's just that that's not the course in life that I'm taking. Well, thank you. Congrats yeah. on your new books. I'm excited. Come <laughs> check me out at BEA, the Book Expo. I'm super excited to see all my fans. Thank you, Vera. Thanks. For more on FAIR, go to fox411.com.